Belvedere, South Dakota. We've been using the armadillo for about four days now. It's been really great. In this video, I'm gonna show you some of the details of the outside of our camper. So our armadillo weighs around 1,800 pounds. The towing capacity of my Jeep is around 2,000 pounds, so we're right about there. Because of its small size, 13 feet, it's relatively easy to maneuver. It has a really good turning radius. It's easy to get in and out of gas stations. We haven't really been unhooking it from the Jeep. We've just been using the feet to stabilize it, and that seems to be working fine for us. So, here we have a screen door and a regular door, obviously, being held open by a bungee. Under here is our propane. I'm not going to lift this up because it's kind of tough to get off, off and on, but we have the propane and the battery stored under that. I highly recommend, if you're getting an armadillo, to get the cover. It is, it's a little bit pricey, but it was worth it because it keeps everything clean other details out here which are nice as we have some external outlets Boop. Two of them. and also the light out here which can be controlled either from in there or you can just control it from out here but we haven't used the awning yet I'll have to do another video when we pull that awning out we've got our spare tire here and one of the best things about it is if you don't have enough storage, you just swing this open like so. lifts up like so and then we keep our electric cords and the hose and stuff in there while we have this open I'll just show you the shower we haven't used the outdoor shower yet but here it is this the shower head just pulls out and uh, we're looking to get that's gonna I think there's a little hook you can get with a suction cup you can just suction it right to the back of the armadillo and pull the shower thing up and do an outdoor shower. We didn't opt for the water heater, so we don't have hot water, but that's fine. We'll just have a nice cold shower to wake us up in the morning. So around this side, we have your standard hookups. Right now we're hooked up to water. We're not using the water tank. We're just using the direct water for our sink. Again, no hot water, just cold water, but that is an option. There's the waste. And there's the power. If you do a place like KOA, you can get water and power. If you are camping in the woods, you just fill up your water tank and use your solar panel. What's been your favorite part of it? Do you have a favorite part? The stickers. The stickers? The armadillo sticker, right? And like a nice comfy bed and my family Aww. in it. 